These are my three weapons I would choose if a zombie outbreak happened. My Glock 19, 9mm, Ruger 10-22, racked with Tapco furniture, BX-25 magazine, the Mosin Nagant, 7.62 by 54R, bolt action. These are the three weapons I would choose if a zombie outbreak happened out of my collection. Now if I could go to a military base and pick up three different weapons, I bet you it wouldn't be these three. Probably be a G18 just because it's the exact same thing, fully auto, you know, and then full auto something else. But these are what I have for my zombie outbreak. Um, the reason I choose these, they're cheaper. Uh, ammo's way cheaper than your you know, your AR-15, your AK-47, your 40 Smith & Western, or 45 auto, your 308, 30-06, 30-30, and these calibers, or these choices. So this is a Mosin Nagant um, Army Surplus Weapon. It's cheap. Uh, if you're into zombies and you have no guns and you're capable of buying a gun, you should start with one of these. You could shoot these far as shit. I've only shot at 100 yards. Uh, my range is only 107, so that's as far as I went. You can buy these as low as 100 bucks, all the way up to 200, depending on what kind you like. This is a hex receiver, so it's a little more pricier. When I bought it, it was at least. Really smooth action. Awesome gun. Uh, like I said, fits five in the mag, which is built in to the gun, so it takes a clip. You put five on there. Put on there, it's a stripper clip. I don't use them though. I just use this little side set, set saddle thing right here, and I can throw them in there. Pop, pop. Ruger 10-22. There are cheaper um, 22s out there, but I like the Ruger 10-22. I've used it since I was a kid. Uh, I just really love the Ruger 10-22s. The only issue I have with them is the bolt doesn't hold back on the last shot, which I really like that in other models like the Remington really just the Remington I mean I'm sure there's other models but that's the only other one I've shot that I can remember off the top of my head you can do so much with these if you don't like this look you can go with the plain Jane look you can go with the sniper look um, just really any kind of look possible different barrels you can build them nice you can build an expensive one you can have a cheap one the Ruger 10 22 is the best Ruger, the best 22. You can tell I'm a fanboy. And this is the Tapco, Tapco furniture, Ruger BMX 25 magazine. They only come with 10 round mags. And then uh, Ford grip. I got this on there and, whoa, that wasn't in there. And I got that on the rail so when I hold it, hold it like that or more like that I can wrap my finger around it and it's all smooth so I don't hit that picadero it's man it's this fun 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 gun to shoot got a little red dot on there pop off those zombies heads real quick Glock 19 I like this because 9's more available 22's more available that's not really available, but dirt cheap. Um, a box of 100 white box for this is about 25 bucks. So you're looking at about 100 rounds for $25. The Ruger 10 22, 22 ammo. Um, there was a scarce for a while. It is coming back around, so you can find the 22 depending on how bad you want to look for it, where you go. Walmart generally doesn't have it, but your local gun shops do. Or in my area, I live in Utah, they normally have them. But uh, you can get a bolt pack of this, 550 to 500, or 500 to 550 for about 25 bucks. So you got 500 rounds for 20 bucks on one of these. Most of them I got the big round. This is a 7.62 by 54R. You can get these right now, 100 bucks surplus uh, ammo. Obviously, they do have the nicer match ammo and all that good stuff. But shooting a zombie. I'm not going to pay a dollar fifty for the round. 
This is a hundred bucks for 420 rounds in a spam can. Pretty good deal for a big 30 cal bullet. That's you can't beat that. That's why everybody should have a Mosin. They're awesome. Everybody should have a 1022 and some type of pistol. Obviously, when I mean everybody, everybody that's capable of having one. Don't obviously illegally buy one if you can't. Felons and all that good stuff. Just pop off the heads. Pop, pop, pop. And these weapons I would use for a Walking Dead zombie or a Land of the Dead, Dawn of the Dead, Shaun of the Dead. Pretty much any zombie dead in it. Now I think about it. War or Z zombies. Just let me get a bunker and hopefully find a cure for it. Because I'm trying to fight those guys. They're too damn cracked out for me. Uh, light system on all these would be awesome. Because can't always fight them in the dark. I mean in the daylight. Eventually you will have to fight at night. I do have a light for the, the Glock. But I do not have a light for this or that. I would never get a light for that. That will stay exactly like it is. This, I would like a light on the side, but don't. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button up here in the corner. Uh, I'll throw a link for some other videos you might like. Um, I just did a uh, Walking Dead video. Kind of made me want to do this video. More in depth to my three guns I choose in that video, or chose in that video. I do have other guns. Have an AK, have an AR, have a 3030 Winchester, Remington 700, 1911, but I just feel comfortable with these. Light wouldn't really weigh, weigh me down a lot. Uh, this is extremely heavy, but I would sit on top of a building with this one. I would not run around. I have a sling for this one that mounts on a little sling. It's a one-point sling harnessed mounts right there and I have a, a concealed carry holster for this and a black house holster for this they go on my right side and then this will hang over me and I guess I'll use that until the ammo runs out then toss it or use it for a bat because shit I don't know if you familiar with IREC veteran 18888 but he does a pressure um, torture forgot exactly what the video is called, but they take it and they just beat the shit out of that Mosin Nagan. And it, it's, I mean, they take a cinder block and beat it with the butt of this, and it doesn't do anything. That's, that's awesome. That is a zombie weapon right there. All right. It's a pretty long video. Hope you stay tuned to watch it all. Check out some of my other videos. Subscribe, tell your friends, hit that thumbs up on the bottom, do all that good stuff. There's a little bit of ammo right there. Let's mix that up in there. This is 762 by 54 for the Mosin. 9mm, full metal jacket, and Ruger, oh not Ruger, but a 22 long rifle, hollow point. Those are the rounds, cheap.